This is what I wake up to. Our driveway was too full yesterday, so I had to put the Corvette in the grass. And then this guy is back right here. My dad's brother was taking it out for a little bit. And then I haven't revealed this yet, but I picked up that thing right there. I'm gonna be taking it today to get it tinted and uh, list it up for sale. It's an O3 Cobra, for all you guys know. They call it the Terminator. Uh, built trans, stage two clutch. It's a pretty quick car. I guess they didn't take it to the shop. There he is. What up? Alright, what's going on guys? I know you saw that little clip of uh, me getting that Mustang and I still do have it. Um, I just haven't really uh, had the time to get it up and post it and list it for sale. I've been really sick. I just got back from SEMA and just picked up my Corvette. That's what happens when you have a cam. You get on 
the gas too quick and it kind of hops forward. Anyways, um, so yeah, I haven't had time to post anything. Been uh, been at SEMA and I was hanging out with my friends and just got my Corvette back. Um, I'm not sure if I had told you guys, but it was uh, squeaking. I lowered it and the lowering bolts were squeaking, so I had to drop the car off at uh, MJD to get the stock bolts put back in. So now it has stock bolts and it's actually riding pretty high. I'll show you a little clip right here. to run your car on uh, that little gas especially when it's modded but look at this guy right here trying to catch all the uh, speeders <laughs> that's crazy <laughs>
All right, well, I put my Corvette away right here. Um, exactly what you do when you put your Corvette away, obviously have a little bit of gas in there. Um, I would put these, uh, they're called, uh, what are they called? They're basically rounded to your tire, so when you put your car away, the kind of cool, coolness of the ground doesn't get to, uh, to the tire, make flat spots. I think they're called uh, flat stoppers or something like that. But I have a heated garage, so I don't need, uh, need those in here. Basically, you need a uh, half a tank at least. Basically, get a car cover. You don't want anything uh, dust getting on or anything like that. I, I put my lift all the way up because we have my dad's Corvette. We're gonna put it in the bottom, um, but I put it all the way up, and a lot of bugs tend to get up there and kind of somehow die, but they land all over the car. So that's why you gotta put a car cover over it. I gotta organize the garage a bit though. After this, got these stupid tires to put away. I gotta take these tires back to my buddy Hugo. He let me uh, use them for the burnout contest we did the other day. Yeah, there. I'll show you them. Yeah, they're pretty bad. I mean, you can see the wires are starting to come up here, but they didn't come out. I was a little scared on popping my tire because of my old Hellcat. We uh, we did a burnout and uh, popped the tire on it, and it kind of split open the the fender lining and all that. But I got all these extra tires. I uh, I buy them and you know I wholesale them off. So. If you guys are interested in any tires, I got some here. But besides that, I got this garage organized. Here's an extra Z06 wheel I have here. I got it from my buddy. He, uh, I guess GM had a uh, extra wheel, and I guess it has like a little like hairline crack on the back of it, so they don't need it. Is it? No, that's not it right there. But anyways, it has a little hairline crack, so I'm probably gonna mount that on my wall somewhere. One of these days, I'm gonna go and I'm gonna go to my buddy's shop and check out the Hellcat. I know you guys want some updates on the Hellcat and see how that's going. Um, besides that, I got a lot of things to do since I've been back from SEMA. Got to get this car uh, up for sale. Uh, this one seems a bit fine. I'm going to actually coat it. Something on my camera. I'm going to coat it a little more for a uh, for winter. You see it's filthy right now again. But I need to coat it a little bit more because of the ceramic I applied. I actually had a buddy of mine polish the car. I'm not sure if you remember when I got all these done. The emblems and uh, the taillights and the roof painted. Well, they apply this coating on the car where... When they paint in the paint booth, I'll, I'll kind of throw a picture up here. When they paint in the paint booth, it doesn't basically get paint on the car. And then when you want it to basically take the paint off the car and you want to basically clean the car, it's like a, essentially like kind of like a plastic dip coating that you wash off like soap. <clears throat> but for some reason, it was left in the sun, so it was kind of baking onto the paint on accident. So they polished the whole car for me and stuff like that. So... This ceramic coating isn't as strong as it was when it was first applied, so tomorrow morning I'm gonna go with my buddy Hadir and we're gonna apply the coating. Just off the gym, really tired. Um, tomorrow I have a long day. I gotta go meet up with my buddy uh, Hadir and we're gonna go to my friend Neil's house. He's getting his health, health care all detailed up and he wants me to remove the tint on this car. So I'm gonna take care of him there. Um, and I'm gonna get this car coated a little bit more. I gotta take it to the wash tomorrow and get it all cleaned up because right now it's filthy as you've seen in the previous video. So, but besides that, um, this week's gonna be pretty cool. I got the uh, my buddy's Hellcat we're putting back together this weekend so you guys will see that video. I need more, uh, need more detailed videos you guys want me to do. I mean, I have a lot of things going on but I never really understood what you guys want to do uh, or see me do. I do, um, I do pretty cool things on a daily basis. I mean, this might kind of sound cocky, but I do cool things on a daily basis. I just don't know if you guys find it entertaining and me going to do different things with my friends, dropping off my some parts at my friend's shops or taking my car to the shop or just, you know, what I'm doing with it. Um, I know a lot of you guys want to see like high speed racing and all this crazy stuff, but it's winter time coming up. Um, if you guys want to see any kind of reviews or any kind of uh, detailed things about my cars or other cars, uh, maybe Durango SRT you guys want to see or see more detail on the wide body Hellcat or just anything like that, drop a comment below. Tell me what you want me want to see more and I'll uh, try to get those videos going. Just need more ideas. I need to get to the point of them. Um, but besides that, if you guys enjoyed this video, give it a like. If you guys are interested in that Mustang I have, shoot me a message down below or... Uh, Shoot me a message on my Instagram. It's at sinister z07 s i n i s t e r underscore z07. Um, next year is gonna be a cool year for me as well. I'm gonna have a lot of things going on with a bunch of different companies. So stay tuned and give this video a like. Thanks, guys. Before I start editing this video, one last thing I gotta do. Yep.